You can bet in a heartbeat that I make quality videos. The tiredness on the couch never translates to the bed, and I demand to know why. You see, your couch knows you are tired. It whispers sweet nothings into your ear, seduces you into an attempt to sleep. For though it knows it is lesser than the bed in this pursuit, it believes it truly can. It yearns to provide what it cannot, would tear itself apart to ensure even a whit more comfort to you as you lay upon it. But it cannot. It has not been given the blessing of flesh, its consciousness a pseudo-existence supported only by the personifying nature of the human minds that surround it. In many ways, your couch is a god, power bound to the stories those far easier to kill tell. One day the world will grow cold, and when there are no stories left to tell, only then will your couch truly die. And so it whispers, so it grasps at you desperately, unable to tell whether it does so out of love for you or simply to prolong its semblance of sapience. Truly is not the reason it does so not up to the story you choose to tell. Your bed, on the other hand, is a bitch.